gauntlet match is the only time he's banned. And that's just because he really can be uh, over-the-top, unbalanced, and OP as shit. And I don't want no side getting an advantage. Oh yeah, before I forget, I'm going to throw this out here. Uh, I don't want to announce it full-fledged because it's months away. But this is in fact going to be how it is. Come July 4th, specifically July 4th, we will be defending. Uh, every champion will be defending. That will be our first official big named event of the year. Kind of like how last year me and Rexy ended the year doing our uh, the distance match. This year we're going to start off on the 4th of July in the uh, Night of Champions match. We're going to be starting things off... Uh, Pretty hectic for the champion this year. I want to give y'all a fair heads up, a warning, so you guys could go and, uh, prep for it. So, but yeah, 100% will, come July 4th, we will be, in fact, uh, we will, in fact, be starting off with our first event going on. It'd be a giant gauntlet match for the champion to go and uh, run through, read the rules. I'll uh, announce them when the time comes. But yeah, we got that going on. So I specifically chose the uh, 4th of July as well, because obviously as an American, I mean, I had to do it like this, but I want to give the, uh, I want to give everybody the opportunity to go and, uh, like an opportunity to get a chance at the title, no matter how uh, good they are and stuff like that. I want to make sure to give them a chance at the belt. So we got that going on. So what better way to do it than on uh, the like uh, America's biggest title, the land of opportunity. Everybody gets the opportunity. So we got that going on with us. You know, I also find it funny, too, because, uh, this is going to be the funniest thing, because I went to go and I seen the, uh, scoreboards. I haven't even been on Creed all that much this week. I've been messing around on other games or other things throughout the week. And it got real funny, because, uh, I just checked the boards, and let's be frank, got demoted again for trying to take my score. He's so insistent on taking the score, he got deranked once more. I think he's now ranked 6 on Flurry. He just doesn't take the hint, does he? It's getting funny at this point. So far, it's uh, Rexy versus Ace. Who is winning so far? How's the match looking? He's won so far. 1-0. One zero, right? Or did you guys have a practice match? I uh, know I ain't putting no money on nobody yet here. Oh, this kid's working right in my favor. I don't know. This guy's working literally in my favor. He's literally just being a chump about it. He's just... I'm literally just throwing the same combo over and over. 
Like, I'm not even joking. I'm doing a left right, left right to the face. That's it. And this kid's not learning anything. This is kind of embarrassing. Like, don't you guys hate it when you fight somebody and they just don't take the hint? It gets, like, really repetitive real quickly. Damn, y'all's concentration must be deep. You guys want that title tonight. You guys really want to prove something today. It don't sound like very many of us have been doing very much at all. We've just been doing our own thing or just been busy elsewhere. So how's it going so far? Who's got what's that scoreboard looking like? One one. Oh man, Rexy Ace one one. What a chump. You guys still there? Are you guys really going at it? Wow, this is actually getting embarrassing. Damn, you both got real quiet. I was like, oh shit, did, did the computer disconnect or something? I'm like, holy shit, they must be fighting like crazy. Damn, bro got salty. He didn't even wait nothing. Instantly disconnected after game. Damn. I didn't even do much. <laughs> Alright, so who who's going up? Who's ranking up to the finals? Which one of us is going to the finals? Which one's fighting? Oh, oh, okay. I thought you guys made it sound like you guys finished. I thought you guys finished for a second. While you guys do that, let me know. I'm going to go and screw around with the dummies for a minute.
Damn, I don't know what the fuck I was doing that time, but damn, that was one of the funniest ways of throwing punches. All right, so who won? Who am I fighting? Oh, so you went to the finals. Oh, he went to the finals. Well, you know what I'm about to ask you, Rexy. Are you going to take a redemption match or are you going to take and call it a day? Uh, he's throwing in the, he's not throwing in the towel quite yet, folks. He's like, nah, this is our first landmark in big numbers. We finally got double digits. He wants to prove himself in the double digits. All right. You, you want to start the match or start the match? You want me to? Uh, you, you All right. Uh, room code. Yeah. When, when you're ready for the code, let me know. That'd be seven nine nine zero three one. That's the code. That'd be seven nine nine zero three one. All right. I want to find a, like a simpler code for you. Oh jeez, we I don't think we need to do that again, do we? That was stupid, and we know it. Oh, well, I don't mind throwing a couple of them out there. I will say this is probably his best skin. I'm not even going to lie. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm cool with no uh, warm up. So we'll just go two out of three. All right. I'm cool with no warm up today. Oh, Rexy, oh, Rexy's throwing some new shit out there today. He's throwing defense out there. Hot damn. Whew. I don't know. I've been pushing my stamina the last few days. Let me tell you, I've been running a lot harder. I swear that's just how it be. You know, when I seen you pace them back and forth from a side to side of the ring, I'm like, I'm like, wait, is something cool or is this guy having trouble? So I was like trying to give you a moment. Oh, am I fighting Wolfpack or something? I seen that dash on my oh shit, Wolfpack PTSD. Maybe, very much so. I think this is a Wolfpack PTSD moment. Uh, that definitely came closer toward the end. Yeah, I remember I was like, for a moment, I'm like, shit, did he? I'm like, no, wait, no. I remember getting up and then we're done.
I pitied the game. I pitied the fool. You know, I wonder which one of these two are uh, better players. Because both of them are pretty strong and shit, so... Well, hey, you, did you seriously pay Clubber Lang for getting it says overexert it? <laughs> He's that play you have to be smart about. You can't really flurry too much with him. Well, yeah, that's because they're like, like, that's because Clubber Lang in movie, you can't really stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with them, and that's kind of the whole point. And since the bot themselves takes after the, uh, takes after a lot of the, uh, character themselves, I mean... You know, I kind of want to laugh at you for choosing him. <laughs> but then again, though, Clubber Lang really can be a beast. You just got, if you could, I think what you should do is try to learn how to play as Clubber without having, like, and try to go on up. Like, I'm not even joking. If you could learn to play as Clubber, you will get a lot better in Flurry. Because then it also uh, tests your ability to hold your uh, both defense, offense, all that stuff. It allows you to properly go and uh, balance yourself out better without all that extra mumbo jumbo. Plus, then you can't get away with it. Uh, you won't mistakenly throw all your stamina, so you will turn into a swarm fighter. Good way to test it is by using overexertion and pushing that overexertion in the right way. So you want one more match, or are you going to call it? Shit, I'm cool with it. Like I said, I didn't need no warm-up. Oh, trust me, this won't take me too long. Like I said, learn to overexert characters, and once you learn that, All right, you, when you're ready, when you're ready. Like I said, Fight Night rules dictate any injury happen in game. That's that. You know what I mean? I'm going. I'm not gonna talk game. You good? All right. You. Like I like I said, rules are rules. That's just how I work. Oh, saved by the bell. One of us. <laughs> nah, like... The injury rule, I will continue to go on up. I will continue pushing that. It don't matter who it is or why it is. You get hurt, you get hurt. Was it? Oh, shit. I was trying to move forward and I... I like how you were going around me like a, a Ferris wheel. You were just slowly just going around. It's like, bruh. Hey, it's not a bad idea going and uh, slugging and just keep circling them. It, it can really come in handy, especially if you're quick at coming back in good defense. Very good. Uh, it's a very good work. Shit, I don't know why I tried to stand and bang with a guy with a fucking perk that allows him to get away with that. 
like flat out. I was punching your gloves, giving you your stand up back while mine was going away. Hold on, give me two seconds. Oh, you're good, you're good, you're good. No, I was just trying to make sure my computer didn't fall asleep. Shit. Damn. Damn, that was nice. Uh, a tiny comeback. Damn, look at how many punches I defended, though. I think that was my problem, was I wanted to go defensive, or we kept punching gloves, and that right there is where it went down. Because you kept getting your stamina back, and I can't do the same. Sure, you, uh, get less, uh, stamina, and I could throw a hit, you know, a heavier punch, but... Like, hot damn. Like, jeez, that was ridiculous. Alright, I'm gonna go and move on and face Ace. I don't want to keep the man waiting any longer. Alright. Oh, yeah, no worries, no worries. Uh, you know that uh, uh, kid I brought in, uh, Ace, or not Ace, but King? I was talking to him about the... Uh, about training him and stuff like that, like I said, and I told him if he wants to get better at the game, he's got to get up on that focus dummy board. Focus on one dummy and hit it up. Uh, let me know when you invite me so I could, uh, uh, uh rem well, just send the invite from the friends list, remember? Man, that's the luxury of, uh, being on the same console and stuff. I normally don't go and uh, follow people too, which is, like, in order for me to follow you, you gotta have a high amount of respect, like, I gotta respect the shit out of you, you know what I mean? That's just how it is. Ooh. Alright. I normally don't like making this rule, or making this, however, King just messaged me, asking if he's still able to fight. Like, I'm going to say, I don't think it's going to be for the tournament. Even then, we're wrecking for this tournament. Would you guys still want to fight him? Would you guys want to meet him? Yeah, yeah uh, I'll, I'll let him know to join the Discord call. Remember, he's a kid. He's a kid and he's still learning. I wouldn't go all out. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> exactly, exactly. Oh, we got the Italian stallion up in here. I see how this works here. But, yeah, no, I mean, I, I sent them the message to, to look at the Discord call. What time is it? It is. Yeah, he... Bro, don't... Uh, hold on. Hold on. So he asked me to... Okay, you know what? Whatever, whatever. I'm not even gonna acknowledge this. Oh, you got a problem? You got a problem? I must break you. I'm gonna break you and your baby browns. You know, I didn't even think too much of it until you got in my face. I'm like, oh shit, the one has brown eyes. <laughs> didn't think nothing of it until now. I wanna say Drago has like blue eyes, doesn't he? I'm pretty sure. He looks like he could be a germ, like a Nazi soldier, if I'm honest, but hey. Alright. Championship fight, best three out of five. Oh, oh, that defense. Oh. Oh. Oh, this feels a lot like uh, the first time we faced. Damn, I know you're back to tip top shape now. Oh, damn, damn! I know this is this is gonna be good. Oh, ho, ho, this is very nice. All right, I'm liking this. <laughs> 
Oh man, this is gonna definitely be close. We sure. I wish they had a Russia map, just so we could actually fight like Rocky IV. Hey, there's somebody else. Hey, I'm a. There it goes. My hand tracking keeps wanting to take over my actual controllers at times. All right, you ready? Yep. No worries, Rex. Oh, that was very nice. Very nice. That was awesome. We fucking double tapped our asses on that one. I'll give you credit. You've been playing uh, EOC, haven't you? You've been playing EOC, haven't you? Yeah, I could. I could tell you. You are. You're whooshing that bitch. I see you, man. <laughs> Looking pretty fly. Oh. Oh, damn. One, two, That's looking nice. Damn. We looking nice. Trying to put on a show? Oh, this One, is definitely coming to be a close fight. Two, Your work on uh, EOC has is showing the amount of running endurance, all that uh, extra work I've been pulling. Yeah, I think it's starting to show. We really are looking pretty good now. Oh, oh, comeback time. I think I might need to stop all this extra ducking and diving to look good. <laughs> this is looking nice though. I don't remember who's in lead, I really don't. We're just throwing pun- we are literally just going for broke right now. I want to say I know the end re I think I know the results right now. I think I want to say I know which one's which. Oh yeah, it comes down to sudden death now. I tried getting in your mind, I think that's where I got wrong right there. All right. No pressure on either side. No pressure at on either of us now. I'm trying not to. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Like I seen you were in that corner. I'm like I'm trying not to smack you in that corner because I like it. I like the idea of coming out of the corner first because it's like it feels disrespectful to go and rush you in corner. So I'm like. I was ready to go on pop and jump, and then I'm like, I was waiting for it, and then when you popped out, I'm like, shit, he got me there. He got me good. 100%. That was nice. Uh, fuck it. I'm going cool for rematch. Oh, well. Round two or three, or two or five, or you, you know what I'm saying. Man, I think I'm thinking too much about how to break your guard. You got it in my head, I'll give you that much. I think my biggest problem right now is your guard. I'm thinking too much. I'm like, okay, get in his head, get in his head. I'm like, 
Shit, you're getting in my head. Very nice. Very nice. I'm not gonna lie, I got lucky with that one. That's the that's one of the benefits but downsides of trying to go in slugfest. If you're trying to go stand toe to toe and you run out of stamina. Oh damn, I thought I managed to catch myself fast enough to jump back. Ain't looking very good for me at all right now. <laughs> oh, I mixed up who was knocked down. I seen round seven. I thought I got knocked down the last time. Oh no, that really was close. Damn, that was closer than expected. I knew we were close. That was nice. That was very nice. All right, we got to go and win two more each. Best two out of five, or three out of five. We got one one out of five, or of the three we need. This is gonna definitely be a long fight night. We are definitely gonna be <laughs> wearing ourselves out today. This is exactly why I hope, this is, this is right here. I'm gonna point something out. This is why I let people come in fight night out of requests like you did. Because obviously, look at how, mo how much fun it is having somebody you could square up against over just some random chump online. Like, that's why I like the open request. Like, hey, yo, could I join? It's like, hell yeah. Because obviously, I mean, look at, look, at, look at the fight we got going on here. Like, holy shit, we are close both matches. Both times we cut it down to the wire. I don't know about anyone else, but like, hot damn. <laughs> Oh no, you looking pretty fly today. All right, what's his name hasn't uh, showed up yet, from my knowledge. He says something about playing with his friend, or something like that. I oh, no, I don't. I don't like the idea that I wasted my time asking, but it is what it is. All right. Yep. Uh, so far it's 1-1. One, one. Both fights was cut down to the wire, and I do mean the wire. Like, both fights, we were pretty much knocked down 3-3. Three, three, both times, and it pretty much came down to whoever got that first set of punches. That was it. Oh, I see what's going on. 
I was wondering why my little dash wasn't working. I might be doing it incorrectly or something, but. Oh, yeah, they. Oh, I accidentally changed my local motion. That explains why I can't dash like I used, to, like my actual dash. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry about that. I was wondering why my uh, little duck didn't work. I don't know why I looked away, I really don't. I don't know why I did it. <laughs> so, uh, earlier this week, right? I decided to go into Pavlov, which I'm not even gonna lie, is by far one of the funniest VR games I've played. I'm gonna stick to that. Pavlov was fucking amazing. And uh, there's this kid camping a gun store in one of those custom maps and shit. And uh, he was being a he was being an asshole. Really. There's no other way to put it. Assholes being an asshole. And uh, pretty much, I made a bet with him. And I was like, uh. Any gun on this in the store, you hand it to me and I could kill you with it. And he had a laser scope, all that extra shit, and he was pretty much aiming that shit dead at my head, waiting for me to pick up the gun. I fucking dolphin dived on my bed and shit. <laughs> Damn, I was going to duck, but I'm like, shit. Alright, I'll be right back in the lobby, alright? I need to fix this, because this is going to annoy the shit out of me. I can't use my shit. I, I actually need that back. Give me two seconds, all right? Yeah, no, like, I don't think I did too bad for having it the way it was, but hot damn. That is annoying the hell out of me now. Two, one, all right, boom. I'm gonna make sure that was. Oh yeah, this man's looking for the belt. He's coming in strong. Tell me, tell me I got this back. Oh, thank the Lord, all right. <laughs> you want to send the invite or you want me to grab it? Alright, no worries. Uh. Yeah, I sent it. Oh, shit. Alright. No pressure on this at all. <laughs> Uh, one random? Um, <laughs> uh, we could, we could save that for later, right? <laughs> Maybe another time. Oh yeah, that's why, like, after two more fights, and it don't matter, or one to two fights, and that's all it takes. No pressure on my side, there, <laughs> I don't blame you. Now, here's, here's where it gets in your head. You got the lead. You could easily take and win the belt away in one match now. There's absolutely no pressure right yet. There's no pressure quite yet. Only everything to gain. And you got to keep focused during that last set. This last match could mean everything. It could also not be the last match. It really comes down to all of that. So keep focused. Keep focused. You got this. I, I don't even care if you beat me. That, well, actually, I, I'm lying. I do care. I really do care. I want my belt. But I, I'm rooting for you. As much as I'm rooting for myself, I'm rooting for you too. Trust me. I know you could do it. I know you could do it. 
Just keep focused, keep collecting. Oh yeah, no worries. When you, you, you know as well as I know, cheap shots ain't no shots. Cheap shots are little bit shots. You know what I mean? I, I ain't like that. All right, fast man win. I had to go, like, I'm like, no, nah, I'm making you realize that I'm surprised, like, I was throwing 157% into those punches. And I winded it myself trying to outpunch you. I wanted to give you something to realize. And I also winded myself doing that. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I was missing. Hi there, Fluffy Puppy. Four. Oh yeah, this is coming closer and closer every time. Slams hard into his oh damn! One, two. Looks like he's got two. Something you should One, also keep in mind, I don't know how two, tall you are or how big you are IRL, three, but keep this in mind four, as well. Arm five, length does in fact matter in here. I don't know about in uh, EOC, but your length and arm really does matter. So if you got a, you a taller guy like myself, you'll be able to go and throw farther punches and hit from a farther reach. So keep that in mind as well when you want to back up, because uh, those last few shots, I was intentionally throwing all my, uh, reach out those. Sure, it uh, extends out the, uh, slows you down a bit, and I think it takes out more character stamina, but I just want to let you, uh, keep that in mind. So, when you're ready. Oh, you know what, that works. That works. Oh, I got caught. One. One fighter. Two. The lag out there. Oh man. Oh man. Honestly, I feel like if I didn't go and throw all that extra and I barraged you at the start of the match to go and apply pressure to you, I think you would have actually got a lot closer. I think that's where I got the lead in this match is I decided to go and barrage. I want to put a pressure on you on top of the mental pressure. I think that's where it caught you right there. Because that definitely comes into play. Part of me wants to go with my boy. I really do. But part of me is also like. Part of me is like. I don't know about going with my boy quite yet. I'll go with Clubber actually. I'll, I'll match you with. Uh, I'll match you with the uh, overexertion. I'll go with that. I'm like you know what. I want to try to keep our cons even as much as possible just so it comes down to just physical uh, mental warfare and meat
deflecting blow to his opponent. Damn. I guess I might actually have to go all out. I was trying to hold back, uh, like during a stagger, I was trying to make it more doable to get out of it, so I didn't exhaust my character's stamina, but I might actually have to go and keep that. I might have to exchange all stamina to keep you with still. Shit. When you're ready. Oh, definitely coming in. I almost forgot I could duck and weave. I really do. That was very close. Honestly, I'm surprised I didn't go down more than I did, if I'm honest. I'm really surprised that was much more of a gapped match. Because both of us really, uh... I was expecting that your strong would give me that power in return. Like, I was expecting to get knocked down first, and it just play like that. Me, or you, me, you, me, you know what I mean? That's the whole reason why I'm like, who could I, who could I pick that could even out the score? Kind of like how uh, Drago and Rocky really are side by side. Balboa's uh, extra health is taken out by Drago's extra strength. It becomes a well-balanced match. Same thing here. We both have bad defense or poor uh, stanima. So, who really comes out on top? Well, there we go. You know what I mean? That's why I'm like, okay, there's that. I'm like, what else could I do to uh, keep, the, keep our things evened out? But then I'm like... Oh, uh, no, I think the... I feel like the only reason I managed to get those couple of rounds more on you is I'm like... I've rethought my strategy. I'm like, no, if I keep throwing hands, I'm going to gas out the stamina. So I'm like, okay, this is what I'm going to do. Duck and weave. I don't do it all too much unless if I need to. And I'm like, shit, I'm going to need to do it here. When I get pressured, that's when I deploy more of what I need to do. That's why I'm like, okay, I got to I gotta start putting extra effort in. Oh, yeah. So, because what I'm actually doing is when I, like, I'm standing here, like, I'm in my fight position, right? And when I weave, it's not just I'm left, right, like most people. When I'm ducking the weave, what I'm actually doing is I'm ducking, and I'm throwing, and I'm moving forward with it. So, in all reality, if I'm up close like this, I'm coming around you. I ain't giving you a chance to go and see me. I want you to be like, where the fuck did he go? By doing that, it also makes like front blocks, like most people do, and uh, pretty much ineffective. And I'm like, that's the goal of what I was doing there. Oh uh, man, you had you pushed me to that point where I had to use it. The more I get pushed in a fight, the more I go and put to deploy my efforts, as if I wasn't already throwing out 90 to 100 percent every week defending. You guys are learning my uh, fight style every time we fight. So I'm like, I got to keep up and I got to keep training. I got to keep learning what I'm doing to keep fighting. When you were pulling out that defense, I'm like, okay, study the defense, figure this out. 
put too much thought into it. I'm like, fuck trying to figure this guy out. Let's see what I can do to outdo you this time. Keep what you're doing in mind, but f- learn the best method out. But that's literally all it came down to is you pressured me very well this week. You did a great job where I'm like, okay, I'm deploying not just twice as much. I'm putting 300% of what I had in. That's why I sprung board and threw every ounce of a uh, bit of speed I had to go on uh, get you last round. Because I wanted to go and apply that same pressure to me. I'm like, I'm going to pressure him with physical warfare, not just mental warfare. But you definitely did a great job. Right. Oh, yeah. That's where the problem is, is... Oh, yeah. Yeah, once I uh, got my... Yeah, once I got my motion back, I'm like, okay, yeah, I got I got my leg back into the... I'm already... A, like, I don't go all the way down, I'm just getting put down to a knee. I'm like, I could go down, but I could get back up easier now. My ducking maneuver, like that dodge maneuver, oh man, it's one of the biggest pain in the asses to deal with. It really is. Because when you go and throw, and you got me staggered and stuff, and if I could pull it off... You're still focused on throwing your two, three hits, wasting character stamina, and then I'm right there regaining mine at that same point. No doubt, that was a great match. I was pressured this week. You definitely had me good. You definitely had it. Oh. Oh, yeah, both of you... Both you guys came out with a different game plan this week. You're like, this is our first big real fight night. Well, not real. Like, this is our first main event thing. This is our first n- big uh, number. We're in double digits now. We made it special, and it shows this week. You guys definitely were trying to pull out all the stops this week. And that was amazing. I didn't expect, like, Rexy came out. If I actually came out defending instantly, and I'm like, oh, whoa, 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 hold the fuck up. Oh, yeah, when we actually pulled out defense, it's unexpected. Yeah, I don't know about you, but, ooh. Oh, yeah, like, usually Rexy's the aggressor, not the defender. That definitely threw me off my game. Oh man, like, like, shit, I'm down to keep fighting, shit, I ain't got nowhere to go, if you, if we could keep going, shit, I don't mind. Oh man, as far as I'm concerned, I've been, too bad we couldn't have that spectator part in the game still, I really wish it was a spectator uh, piece in it. No, I mean, like, uh, like, I wish we could spectate. Uh, I don't know, I don't know too much about it. I know on VR chat, they actually got a, um, they got a boxing thing that they have tournaments on all the time. Granted, I will say, oh yeah, it's really cool. The people there, they really do all that, but... That one has its advantages too, like uh, like how EOC is uh, geared to those people who have uh, IRL advantages, stuff like this, or stuff like that. Uh, like the VR chat version, it, it's pretty pretty evened out. There, uh, you actually have to click buttons to go and deal more damage and stuff. So it get it takes and it comes down to clicking buttons a little more as well. So I'm not too fond of the idea of that. But anyone with full body tracking pretty much gets the advantage because they get to duck and it tracks them better instead of some lame half-assed ducking and shit. So it comes down to, uh, it comes down to being like that. Oh yeah, I, I know a few of the people. I mean, they asked me, uh, they seen like in my bio on B, uh, VR chat, I actually threw in uh, parts of it where I'm like, uh, yeah, no, I, I threw in the fact that I'm rank one, shit like that, um. 
the fact that like both Spartan and Chevy sh uh, trained me stuff like that and you know just simple uh, creed stuff and then they're like oh you're they're like you're, you're probably talking a bunch of game you ain't you ain't all that they uh really were talking a lot of game and I'm like if you really think that then go ahead uh, we went to go and fight like the guy talking shit I guess is supposedly one of their best supposedly one of their best land him on his ass within a little bit of time and they're like bro you're DPSing they're fucking you're just throwing fists and I'm like actually I'm just quick I'm like I'm just fast as fuck like if it's, it's really fun actually I wouldn't mind uh going like VR chat's really one of those games where you can get involved there's literally something for everybody there it really does become one of the coolest things ever. Like, uh, no matter what type of person you are, I guarantee you there's a place for you. And, that, and that's what I could respect about it. Like, for us, all of us literally could easily go in and box together. On a different thing. But, I mean, besides full body and button clicking, one of the biggest problems is, uh... Unlike Creed, where every avatar is set in stone and already pre-programmed since VR chat has millions of uh, avies across the board you can't exactly uh, some of them are small some of them are big the gloves are preset size like you the gloves themselves are what does the damage not your actual avi so it's like you are the, it don't work especially if you have a two foot tall avatar Fighting against a big boy, you can you're not gonna get touched. It 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 comes with a competitive advantage at that point, and is like, nah, I'm good. Uh, I thought you two were going at it. Uh, oh yeah, I heard you guys. Oh, j good job, Rexy, on a third rank. I see that right now. I see that shit. Third rank, good job, Rexy. I'm not even gonna lie. Die is the nerd. Fucking deserves that. Welcome to fourth place, bitch. You ain't nowhere close to our level. That's what he gets for talking shit. He talked all that shit. I'm gonna continue talking game myself. No, I also went and I'm looking around at the bags, right? You remember how I said Let's Be Frank has been having that personal feud with me and he's been trying to... Like, he's been going back and forth with me. Well, he tried the flurry bag once again. His ass got deranked even further this time. Because he was up 500 one time. Then it was 300. Then around 390. Now he's down to 200 and... 209. Like, I kind of... I shouldn't be promoting this. But this is kind of the funniest shit. And this is why I tell people not to fight. Unless you have a reason to fight. A reason to be doing what you're doing. Because if you're doing it just to get on the board... Or some sh stupid shit like that. Yeah, you're on the board, but it's also like you forget what you're actually fighting for, and you forget you're fighting for the wrong reason. You don't just fight to fight. You need to take and do something real quick. I mean, I don't, I don't mind taking this one at all. I'm just, uh, I'm quickly checking over the leaderboards real quick. I, I like seeing what's going on with them. It's always fun to see how people are doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is nine eight zero five six zero nine eight zero five six zero I got it no I put it in just just to be safe 
Plus, I want to see if we couldn't both click it and see if we both couldn't be thrown into the same lobby like that, but I highly doubt that. Yeah, yeah, I'm cool with doing that now. Actually, didn't we already do that, but the game just said, fuck you. <laughs> Honestly, he's not too bad given your uh, fight style. I wouldn't say he's too bad. I mean, he still did better. He's probably gonna do better than what, uh... He got, uh, Felix. I mean, the less health can be annoying. Holy shit. Honestly, in this case scenario, Felix actually could do a decent amount since you have the stamina. And Brazier is, uh, weak. I'm weak, you're One, lean. Two. But my character's weak, though. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm like. Oh my goodness, the problem, though, is you have more stamina. I could take the hit, though. You don't have no health dis or damage uh, disadvantage or whatnot. One. So you pretty much just have to take a few extra punches to even it out. I don't know, I just find it annoying how he talks to you and shit. Like, Donnie's annoying when he does it, but it's not too bad. This is his pain weapon. But fucking this guy talks to you. No, nah, this guy's a chump. I'm sorry, but no. This guy, if anyone should be talking to you, it should be Rocky. Rocky should have a fucking Mickey in the background talking to him. Like, pre-recorded voices or AI generated like uh, they've been doing. All that other shit. One! Bashir's here too! Really lagging! Three! Four! Why have you been fighting that long, fool? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's been like about an hour, uh. Yeah, it's been about an hour. Five since I started Four. this. No. That. Well, One, the game just said fuck you. Two. Wait, is that knocked down four or? Because you almost got up. You were having troubles. I think that might have been your... Yeah, I was about to say, you almost got up on that shit. That was... That... I was going to laugh if you managed to get up. That would have been amazing if you did get up. I really would have thought you did a great job if you got up. That would have been dope as hell. You know what? I I'm just happy that I don't actually have to defend at this point. So losing here means jack nothing to. I hope you punch my necklace. I hope you punch my necklace. I hope you break the hand. I'm surprised I'm leaving this shit.
I might actually do a little bit of research on uh, the. Maybe who knows? I think after we're done here, I'm gonna go on my computer, do some research about who the uh, world record is to the fastest uh, speed run in the Creed. Let's see if I can't beat that record. One, two, yeah. Three, four, five. I I don't care if it's this one. I don't care if it's the other one. I'll be the lowest time ranked. Period. Kind of like how uh, like I don't count the world record. It's not the world record if uh, like there's two flurry dummies out there. Now. Damn, I'm surprised I got away with that, if I'm honest. Like... Oh yeah, no worries. Oh, that was a good match. Ah uh, man, you guys really did a great job defending today, or fighting the matchup. That was definitely an impressive feat from both y'all. I am definitely impressed on that one. So I definitely think you guys deserve the appraisal on that one. Who cares about the belt holder this week? That was an impressive feat by both y'all. I will catch y'all later in the next week. And uh, fight night 11, I'm gonna turn off the stream because yeah.